how to fix unable to connect to NVIDIA. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the unable to connect to NVIDIA error that happens when you try to open GeForce Experience or update your drivers. This usually points to a network issue, blocked service, or a problem with NVIDIA's backend. First, open the GeForce Experience app and see if there's a retry button. You will usually see it right here. Now, click on that and if it still fails, close the app completely using the task manager. We'll, we'll get to that later, but before you do that, let's go to our file explorer first. Now, once we're in our file explorer, look for your program data folder and then head over to the NVIDIA. Um, NVIDIA Corporation folder. Instead of the NVIDIA one, make sure that you click on this NVIDIA Con Corporation right below it. Once you click on that, it's going to take you to this NVIDIA Corporation folder and you will see several other folders. And then from here, you can see this net service just below the G f experience so click on that net service folder to open it now once you're here you're going to look for the ns manage tasks.xml and then you're going to right click on that and then click on delete so you're going to delete this file okay now, after deleting that file, make sure that it has been completely deleted. Now, after that, we're going to open the task manager. This is what I've been telling you about earlier that we're going to close the app completely once the XMS have been deleted. So open your task manager and then look for the NVIDIA um, Corporation or NVIDIA Network Service. Now. This NVIDIA Network Service 32-bit, what you're going to do is to just click on that and then click on this end task right here. So you can find it right here at the bottom right corner of the task manager window. Now, after clicking on that, you're going to restart your GeForce NVIDIA or the GeForce experience. And that's about it. That's how you fix unable to connect NVIDIA error. Once you follow all of these steps, your GeForce experience should be opening by now. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below and I'll do my best to help you out.